The white mother of a biracial daughter is chiding Southwest Airlines tonight, saying they were racially profiled and detained on suspicion of human trafficking. Now, this happened in Denver on a flight from San Jose. Crown 4's Dan Kerman joins us now live with details on this story. Good evening, Dan. Good evening. This mother thinks that this was clearly racial profiling and racial harassment simply because she and her daughter are of different colors. She says this was absolutely the wrong conclusion to jump to of human trafficking, and now she is calling Southwest Airlines out. Southwest Airlines called in to the Denver police, the Denver International Airport, a suspicion of human trafficking involving my daughter and myself. On October 22nd, Southwest Airlines passenger Mary McCarthy and her 10-year-old daughter Moira connected in San Jose on the way to McCarthy's brother's funeral in Denver. As they exited the Southwest jet in Denver, they were detained on the jetway by a Southwest gate agent and two uniformed police officers. McCarthy filmed part of the encounter as her frightened daughter cried in the background. You the flight attendants were just concerned about about the behavior okay. when you boarded the aircraft. That, uh, okay. That's all we're following up on. We're not sus we're not suspecting anything. But that turns out not to be entirely true. This police report she obtained indicates a Southwest flight attendant contacted authorities believing McCarthy was involved in human trafficking. What was the supposed evidence? Their claim that we boarded the flight suspiciously late. That. We allegedly did not speak to each other during the flight. And that we allegedly, I allegedly forbade the flight crew from speaking to my daughter. None of those three claims are true. McCarthy says this is nothing more than racial harassment and racial profiling on the part of Southwest Airlines, and she wants them held accountable. We had been profiled for being a white mother with a biracial black child. I have no doubt that if I had a daughter who was blonde, that we would have not had to go through this trauma. In a statement, Southwest Airlines says, we were disheartened to learn of this mother's account when traveling with her daughter. We are conducting a review of the situation internally, and we will be reaching out to the customer to address her concerns and offer our apologies for her experience traveling with us. Our employees undergo robust training on human trafficking. Above all, Southwest Airlines prides itself on providing a welcoming and inclusive environment for the millions of customers who travel with us each year. Now, McCarthy and her attorney still have not heard back directly from Southwest Airlines. At this point, they are considering filing a federal civil rights lawsuit. Reporting live, Dan Kerman, Cron 4 News.